Hello everyone. In last lecture, we have discussed elastic limit. In today's lecture, I am going to discuss Hooke's law and different types of elastic moduli. Okay. Now let us see what is Hooke's law. Hooke's law states that within elastic limit, stress is directly proportional to strain. That is, stress is directly proportional to strain. We have already discussed that elastic limit. That is, we have taken one object, then we have taken one object, then what, what we have done? We have fixed its one end and it is having some cross sectional area A and length L. Then we have applied some amount of force F between region something 1 Newton to 8 Newton then what happens when we remove this deforming force this body will regain its vernal size and shape then what we have done we have increased this deforming force that is from 9 Newton to 12 Newton then what happened when we remove this deforming force that is from 9 Newton to 12 Newton this body does not regain its vernal size and shape it is due to the property of plasticity and if I increase force to 30 Newton then what happens the object will break into two parts it is breaking point and also we are when we plot graph of stress versus strain for this situation we will get a nature of graph like this here we state Hooke's law that from 0 to certain point that is up to elastic limit stress is directly proportional to strain and when we cross this elastic limit stress is not directly proportional to the strain and we define Hooke's law that this limit that is within this elastic limit here stress is directly proportional to strain this is the Hooke's law Hooke's law states that within elastic limit stress is directly proportional to strain I stress is equals to here we are going to take a proportionality constant that is m then what happens stress is equals to m into strain where m is the proportionality constant called modulus of elasticity therefore what happens if we interchange these terms we will get m is equals to stress divided by strain that is m is equals to stress by strain where m is the modulus of elasticity and there are three types of elastic constant the first one is Young's modulus and the second one is bulk modulus and third one is modulus of rigidity